Hello, welcome to Nina's Knots Crochet. I'm Lynanne. If you're new here, hi, thanks for stopping by, checking out my channel. My channel, it's all about crochet, a little bit about knitting, a lot about yarn, and my journey in this fabulous yarny community. Returning subscribers, hi, thanks so much for coming back, spending a little bit of your Friday with me for Vlogmas Day 23. Cannot believe we are in the home stretch. So Vlogmas, what am I doing for Vlogmas? Uh, you've probably heard me say this a million times. Well, at least 23 times. Um, I'm making a square day. Um, it's a scrappy dappy doodah day, scraps of love blanket that will be put together when I'm done for Bogey Creek. And uh, it was a brainchild of Lynette and Nancy. Uh, she's got yarn too and Charm for Grammy crochets. All those podcasters that are doing it, I have them listed below. So my squares, I am doing a eight round square. I'm using a Red Heart Super Saver, Jumbo Stripes in the color Favorite Stripes and a White Karen Baby Cake using a six and a half millimeter hook. And here's just today's square. Doesn't that kind of look holiday-ish with all that green and red? kind of fitting, right? So yeah, this is today's square. I will get those ends sewed in. That's terrible. Um, so yeah, we're, you know, almost done. This is, this blanket is going to be so cute when it's done. I am so excited about it. And I'm hoping that I'll be able to catch up with Nancy next week and get this to her. Um, our other Vlogmas activity is our now empty black box. Holy cow, guys packed so tight. What in the world was that? So we're down to two boxes in here. And we got box number 23. Aww. They're the hang in there kittens. I think that's what I call them. Oh, aren't those sweet little kitties? So yeah, these are perfect. Again, uh -huh, see what I did there? Perfect. Um, I wouldn't use these as a stitch marker because of the pointy tail, but definitely a progress keeper. Super cute, super light. She's done a really good job. Uh, Studio Seville. Uh, as an Etsy shop, she's listed below. You know, if you haven't already, check her out. She's, like I said yesterday, th this was put together so well. I'm really enjoying it. So that's day 23 with one more to open. Um, as far as crochet is concerned, I took all of your advice yesterday um, and I decided I'm going to make a triangle shawl. Um, I'm doing it in Tunisian. Surprise, surprise. Um, I picked out these Willow Yarn wheels. I had gotten a bunch of these not too long ago um, from Hirschner's. And I am using the color Kingfisher. And it is so pretty. Um, these are... I'm looking at it upside down. 70 acrylic, 30 wool. It's a number three, but it feels a lot thinner than a number three to me. But then what do I know? I'm not an expert. Um, hand wash, lay flat to dry. It says use a 3.75 millimeter hook. Well, Tunisian is always tight. So I always go up. I am using a, I think I've got a six and a half millimeter hook. My, I'm not using a pattern. Um, I'm doing it kind of like I did my not so ugly, ugly Christmas sweater that ended up being a throw. Um, I'm doing a st stitch sampler. So I started at the bottom down here, and of course it's rolling. Um, with a simple stitch and I did 18 rows of a simple stitch. And then on the next row, I did 18 stitches in on simple stitch and then switched to the knit stitch. So every row starts with 18 simple stitches. So it's going to create this border 
and then I do the stitch. So I did knit stitch for a big section and then I switched to the purl sec to a purl and I don't know what I'm going to do next. Um, but I'm loving how this edge looks, this border is looking. With Tunisian, a lot of the stitches require you to use either an even number of stitches or multiples of. There are some that says just, you know, stitch how many ever you want. So I've been looking through this little trusty book that I got um, and I've picked out a couple other ones. I think I can do the reverse stitch is one of them I can do. This grid stitch is one I can do. The mirror stitch is one I can do. So there's there's some more in here that I can uh, practice with. It's And that's what it is. It's, this is just a way for me to practice the skill, to practice uh, putting stitches together. Um, if it doesn't work out, frog it. I mean, that's, that's the beauty of being creative or don't frog it and leave it be. Um, mistakes can be art. I'm okay with that. So we'll just, I'm just going to, I'm definitely just winging a prayer here on this one and it'll, it'll turn out to be something beautiful. I'm sure. Um, but it's just, it's a way for me to practice and we all need practice. And so, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm loving this yarn and it is stitching up so beautifully. Um, I've already had to frog it a couple of times. Um, only not like frog, like a whole big section, but I forgot my count and I had gone past 18 stitches a couple of times. So I had to come back a couple of stitches, but it, it frogs really easily and it, it has beautiful stitch definition and it's, it's going to be a pretty it's going to be a pretty project when I'm done with it. I love the colors. So that is Vlogmas Day 23. Can you believe it? Holy cow. Um, you can see behind me a little bit of my fireplace. The This up here, that my daughter uh, painted. And the one down here at the bottom, the snowman down here, she painted that one. Uh, she's so talented, my daughter. I think tonight when I have all my lights on and all my uh, candles are lit, I have battery operated candles that are on timers. I think I might make a quick little video and show you all of our Christmas decorations. Um, I'll put it in a short instead of a regular video so you can just kind of see how, you know, me and... Mr. Nina, <laughs> I guess that's what we'll call him. I don't know. Or we can call him what the kids call him, Peepaw. Um, how we decorate um, for Christmas in Florida. So in the meantime, I hope you all have a fabulous Christmas Eve Eve. And if you watch Friends, you know what that is. Um, that's what my daughter will be sending me a text any minute now that will say Merry Christmas Eve Eve. So... Until tomorrow when we can see you again, be kind to everyone.